everyone. Welcome to another edition of How to Cook Your Catch. I'm Chef Jason at Shoal Blom Beach. Uh, we just got off another trip on the Amigo uh, with bass fishing picking up. Uh, we're going to do a recipe here. Today we're cooking calico bass, but you can also use this for your uh, sand bass that you catch. Um, this is going to be a fun one. We're going to put it on a salad. So first things first, when you get the fish, it's going to come looking like this. When you get off the boat, they're going to give you this tag so that way you can tell which fish you're actually cooking. From here, you're going to want to fill right here. There's some pin bones. So what we'll do is we'll just slice those little pin bones out. You can also pull these out with tweezers or you can just leave them in. They cook down. From there, we're going to take the nice beautiful side. We have some Cajun seasoning. You can either make this yourself or you can buy it. It's not a problem. It's pretty much cayenne and chili powder and cumin and all those cool seasonings. You're gonna liberally season it, pat it down so everything sticks. And then from here, you're ready to start cooking. So what you'll do, you'll come over to your pan. We have this one already heated. We're gonna add a little bit of oil. We want this pan to be smoking hot, so we'll bump up the temperature. And from there, you're gonna add your fish seasoning side down. And now, depending on the thickness of the fish, it should take a couple of minutes, up to five minutes, depending on how big it is. Here it does the stick. I like to use a non-stick pan, but you're welcome to use a regular pan. And from there, you'll turn the heat off. our plating of the blackened uh, calico bass. Uh, here at Shoal, we do a wonderful Caesar salad. Uh, we call it the LBC. It's a poblano Caesar. So what we'll do is we'll start off with our poblano Caesar dressing along with our romaine. Liberal with the sauce. Tossed well. We'll then plate this. From here we have a couple of toppings. We like to use roasted corn along with some Parmesan. A little bit of pepitas or pumpkin seeds. And we can't go wrong with some toasted tortillas. From there, we'll take our lovely fish, slide it right off onto our salad. And then we have our corn relish, our corn salsa that we made for some of our other fish taco dishes. And we'll just give it a little topper. And there you go. Cajun calico bass on the LBC Caesar salad. So I'm trying some of this fresh caught fish. I think it came from either San Clemente Island or San Nicolas. When you get some fresh caught calico bass, black and seasoned, with all the different flavors of the salad, the Caesar salad we put in there, it's just amazing. It's just like, you can't describe how, how beautiful the fish looks, how great it tastes. There's not one, not one hint of fishiness. It's just pure, pure texture, pure flavor, everything you could ask for in a meal. I just love, love this kind of fish. So now we got a couple different flavors working. I got, think we got the Caesar, we got the, all the different blackened. With the corn, everything just kicks in just right. Oh, I wanna order this every time now. Oh, amazing, beautiful. Thank you everyone for watching another episode of How to Cook Your Catch. I hope you enjoyed our Long Beach Caesar with black and calico bass, and I hope you'll use the recipe for a lot of other dishes and a lot of other fish you catch. Thank you so much and come join us here at Shoal.